Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I woke up at 6 a.m. and I could not fall back asleep, so I've just kind of been laying around since then. It is 10.56 now, and like, I'm finally getting my day started, even though I've been up for five hours. Yeah, five hours. I don't know. I just wasn't feeling it this morning and I couldn't go back to sleep. So I watched YouTube, watched a little bit of Outer Banks, even though I already finished both seasons. I'm kind of restarting it just because I love it so much. And I am gonna go run a few errands. I don't really have that many, but I'm gonna go to Nutrisport. They have really good smoothies. So I'm gonna get one of those because all I've had to eat today was a granola bar and I'm hungry, but like I'm craving a smoothie and I don't wanna make one. So I'm just gonna go get one. And then I am gonna go to Target to see what they have for school supplies because I start classes in two weeks, like a week and a half. <laughs> I start classes in a week and a half. Wow. So I'm going to go see what they have. I definitely want to get like a, a court, not an accordion, find like an accordion, I don't know, file folder thing. I'm having like a complete blank. I don't remember what they're called, but I think I'm going to use that this year instead of multiple folders for each class because I feel like last year I just like either did it feel like pulling out like multiple folders remembering what one was for which class and I didn't even use them honestly so I'm just gonna get like a file thingy this year that way it's all in one place and I have everything I need with me um all the time so I am taking seven classes this semester one of them is a field experience class so I probably won't need much for that one so I'm just gonna get stuff for six classes. I already have three notebooks, like left over from last year. And so I'm gonna get three more notebooks, one of those file folders, um, maybe a pack of pencils, but I don't really think I'm gonna need them. And then maybe um, a school planner. That way I can write out all my assignments because I don't really use like a life planner. I just put everything I like all my events and stuff on my Google calendar on my laptop. So I don't really use one for my like life cause it's all on it's all on my laptop and that way I can have it like on my phone and with me wherever I go. Um, so I want to get a, just a school planner that way I can just write my assignments down and like for future use. So like I have an exam this day, you know, blah, blah, blah. so yeah, that's the plan. I'm going to see what I can find there and hope for the best. I might just look around Target. I need to get a couple groceries. So I'm going to go do that and then I will give you a haul when I get back, but I'll probably talk to you in the source too. Yeah, let's get going. Okay, so I got a Fruity Pebbles um, protein smoothie and it is so good. Oh my God. Let me just show you it quick. Probably you can camera, I don't know if you can see it. I'm gonna dump it out. There's a little Fruity Pebbles in there. This is amazing. I have never been there before, um, but I've just heard that they're super good and they're having like a special right now, like their cereal um, shakes. So they had Fruity Pebbles, um, they had Cinnamon Toast Crunch, but they were out. I don't remember the other ones, but I love Fruity Pebbles, so I got this. Um, they also have just like regular fruit smoothies and then, um, like other protein shakes like cookies and cream peanut butter and they have a coffee one that sounds really good um but i saw this and i was like i have to get that i love fruity pebbles and i don't regret it at all it's so good and it's only 200 calories that's crazy to me because if i was to make this at home it probably would be more so like i don't know exactly what they put in it but mm, not complaining but now that I have this and I can stop being hangry because I'm super hungry, I'm gonna run to Target and see what they have for school supplies. They say the day you die when you meet your past, you can probably hope that I cut you some slack and that wouldn't be too bad if I didn't have to eat. But if I cast sleep in the shower, maybe in the now. Cause now I know the difference. Now I know the difference between a prayer and a preference, between desire and a deference. Uh, Cause I always leave with love a new pouch in my pocket. It's a sweet, slow dripping in my vice grip. It's all gone by the morning, no man. I was born more in the morning.
I don't know what plan is. I think I'm gonna go with this one because it has little rainbows and it has pink. How cute. So the inside of my car is disgusting and I'm gonna get some wipes to clean it. Name brand, Target brand. What do I do? She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's not I really need socks. I I'm gonna wait because they're super expensive here. Look, She's a Mona Fourteen dollars per pack. I could probably get it to you Max for like five. Okay, it is so freaking hot outside, like insanely hot. But I got my school supplies plus um, a toilet scrubber. <laughs> I will show you that when I get home. But my car really needs vacuumed out like bad and I got those wipes so I can wipe down the inside of it. So I'm gonna swing over um, to one of the car washes around here and see if I can just use the vacuum and not get a car wash because the outside of my car really doesn't look that bad. And like if I'm gonna pay for a car wash, to me it needs to be bad to pay for a car wash because I can just have like, I can either wash it at home or have Carson wash it. So I'm gonna go see if I can just use a vacuum and not a car wash, but I'll update you what, what I find out. Okay, so I did have to get a car wash. Um, here the vacuums are free with the car wash, so I just got the base, it was $8, which actually isn't that bad. So I'm getting car wash. Um, eight dollars for the car wash and then I'm just gonna vacuum up my car and wipe everything down I'm really excited to like have a clean car because I have not cleaned my car like this in a really long time so she's gonna be looking good um, as good as she can I guess it's not a super nice car but you know we work with what we have to see there must be something that feeds you found the beauty goes much deeper once you get to me I I'm dripping sweat. I didn't even feel that hot out there. I just felt the drips coming down my face. But she's all vacuumed. Looks a lot better than it did. <sighs> all right. So I ordered that car like cleaning putty off of Amazon and it was delivered yesterday. And I was at work when it was delivered. And um, I got home and it wasn't here and I like just didn't think about it. And so this morning I was like, my putty was not at my door. So I went on Amazon and they usually do like a, like take a picture of it at your door when they deliver it. And sure enough, there was a picture of it at my door and it was not there when I got home. And my friend Tanner, who also lives a couple doors down from me was home. So like, I was like, okay, well maybe Tanner grabbed it. Like either just cause he didn't see my car home just to be nice or he was pulling a prank or something. So like, I wasn't freaking out, but I just went up there and he doesn't have it. I even like went through Amazon and did it like a replacement and he didn't say anything. So like, he doesn't have it, he didn't grab it. So somebody stole my freaking Amazon package and I'm so angry and I'm just praying and they give me a free replacement. Um, I know it's like kind of my fault cause I wasn't here when they delivered it, but I wish they would just put them in our mailboxes because we have mailboxes. They just always put, Amazon always puts the packages by your doors. And like anybody can just grab it and they'll never know. So annoying, but I've never had a problem with this before. And I've literally had packages sitting in front of my door all weekend long, never had anybody touch them. And then I ordered a freaking car cleaning putty and somebody steals it, someone steals it from me. I'm so irritated. And now I don't have my putty and I'm really mad and all I have is my wipes. So I'm gonna just clean my car with my wipes and I'll try to figure out the putty thing. I put in for a replacement on Amazon and like explained what happened and I'm just hoping they were just like understanding and give me a replacement. But yeah, I will update you when that gets figured out. But for now, I'm just gonna wipe down my car. Hold up, hold up, tell me what the hold up is. I'm a little sport, I'll be the first to admit it. I'm not used to laying low about my feelings. To the world or write a book when I 
But, you know, your girl don't have it because someone stole it. So that's not going to happen today. That will happen whenever I get a replacement, if I get a replacement. Um, all I have to do now is just hang up my new air freshener and get the garbage out of here. And then I'm done. Okay, I'm all done. It looks so much better than it did. Let me show you. Literally, my floor was so gross. It looks so much better. But, yeah, it's all clean. Now that I'm out with my car, we'll do a little um, Target school supply haul and I'll show you what I got. So, super random. I was just walking by it and I was like, oh my gosh, I've been seeing these everywhere. My mom uses these. Heard nothing but good things. And I was literally just thinking about how much I hate cleaning the toilet and how gross like the cleaner is. So, I got this disposable toilet scrubber with built in cleaner. So, you don't even need the cleaner. So yeah, and it has five refills, one handle and one caddy. So it just looks all clean in there. Let me open it. Nice. That's what she looks like. Pretty nice. All right. So I didn't get that much stuff. Just got like the necessities. And then when I actually go back to school and like the teachers tell us, you know, like we have like our syllabus. Or a syllabi I think that's plural um then I'll figure out like exactly what I need but for now I got an expanding file that's what it's called I could not remember earlier I got this one it has a little gold detailing on it their school supply section was so picked over and like I'm definitely late to the game because there was like nothing to choose from um I still feel like I'm pretty happy with what I got and I still got like pretty good things but this was not my favorite one and it's a little bit bent up right here in this corner like I'm sure I can bend it back but it was literally the only one that like was somewhat cute so that's what we got for that so that I don't have to use actual folders so and then I only got two notebooks because they didn't have any other cute ones and I think I'm gonna wait to see if I actually even need a six notebook because I have three and then two so I have five we'll see how it goes but I got this one and I love it it has little gold around the um things it's just college ruled on the inside super cute and then this one I absolutely love the outside again so cute and the inside is like even pretty I don't know I'm probably weird for saying that but I got those two notebooks. And then, I'm obsessed with this, guys. I got a planner. And it goes through July of 2021 to June 2022. And I love that because, you know, 21 is almost over, guys. We only have, like, six more months of the year. Five more months. Yeah, five more months of the year. So, I'm glad this one started in July and goes till June of next year. But it's the bigger one because... I feel like the smaller planners, they're just hard to write in and I get annoyed 
because I like to write big and make it cute and all that. So I got the bigger one and it has rainbows. So freaking adorable. The back is just pink. And then it has all the tabs for the months. This is what the month spread looks like. Just a calendar. Um, there's a part for notes on the side. And then this is the week, like the weekly spread. So I like that a lot. Um, see if it has anything else in here that we need to look at. A map, um, like the notes, holidays, and then like contacts, but I'm pretty sure nobody uses those. So that's what we got. And then I am wanting, since I'm gonna be on campus for like literally six out of seven of my classes, I want to actually have like necessary things with me, like hand sanitizer. Um, I got tied to go stick. So I actually got two of them, one for my purse and one for my book bag. Um, just the tied to go because literally I am gonna be on campus for, on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 8.30 to two and there's a lunch hour in there and your girl's a messy eater. So like, this is gonna come in handy. And then I got dry shampoo because literally you never know when you're gonna need a good spray of dry shampoo. I just sweated my butt off cleaning my car and disgusting dry shampoo. Got another one for my um, little to-go bag and my like overnight bag that I take home with me because I'm almost out of it. And then I got this nourishing hand sanitizer from Dove because um, I don't know about you guys, but I absolutely hate using hand sanitizer and how it feels on my hands. And usually they smell disgusting, but with this new Delta variant coming out and like realizing COVID is still a thing and we still need to be cautious, I thought I would invest in some good hand sanitizer that I actually want to use. So I got that. And then I got just tissues because literally like tissues, you can use to blow your nose. You can use the wipe up message. You can literally do everything with tissues. And I feel like I just needed some. And these were like 99 cents, four pack. That way I can put some in my purse, some in my overnight bag, some in my school night bag, school night, school book bag, tissues. Um, That is all I got. But I already have pencils, markers, like highlighters, all that stuff because you know, your girl's obsessed with those things. And I always have them on hand and stocked up. So I don't have to buy new ones every year. Um, but I did want to show you this one thing that I'm freaking pumped to use. So I went to Galena, Illinois with my family last weekend and there was a super cute shop. I got a ring. I got this and these earrings I'm wearing from Pura Vida. They sell Pura Vida there. And it was just so cute. Like literally it was a store for me. That's what it was. But you all know how much I love my weekly planner knock knock pad that I use to plan out all my homework for the week and like assign it days that way I can be like okay I need to get this done today and then just be ready to go you know but the only issue it's not very cute it's literally ugly I don't really like this color orange the setup is just not cute and I'm not a fan of how it looks I'm obsessed with the convenience of it and the purpose but not a fan of the look so Guess what? We're putting this in storage, back in the drawer. And I got this. Look how cute. So weekly planner, week of that. It also has a little section for habits. So like drink however much water, read this many pages. Um, I used to be really into bullet journaling and I was super good at doing habits and like, you know, starting new habits, things I wanna do better at. And now I have a nice little convenient place for it and write them down every week. And then I got a little top goals thing so I can write like my top five goals for the week that I want to get done, that I need to get done. Um, things I'm grateful for, something I'm doing for me, and then a little thing for next week. And then of course the like week boxes that I can write my homework in. And this is a pad just like the knock knock pad. So I can just rip them off, go to the next week so freaking excited look how cute like literally look at the difference why would you not buy this and it was only $12 so I'm winning and I can't wait to use this I am so excited for school to start 
solely for the purpose of using this week planner. Okay, I feel like I just talked so fast and expressed all my excitement into you guys, but I'm literally so excited for school to start. I cannot wait to get back in the groove of like feeling like I have a purpose, like I have stuff to do and I'm not just laying around all the time being bored. I know I'm gonna re definitely gonna change my mind like the first couple months into school, but hey, I'm excited right now. So we're just gonna go with it. And obviously I'm starting on a new school this year, um, a university. So I'm super excited about that to move on to the next step of my life. But that is all I got. I'm hoping to do like a what's in my book bag video to show you guys just like all the stuff I'll be bringing with me to class. Um, my little like necessities bag I'm going to put together and like all the pencils I already have. You guys will see those in that too. But I'm really excited to make that. Um, I'll probably do that closer to when school starts, like actually starts so I can get my bag actually put together. Um, but yeah, that is it for the haul. And I don't think I'm going to really do much the rest of the day given it's only 1.30 and I already feel like I've been up for a whole day. That's fine though. Um, I already took a nap this morning. Maybe I'll take another nap. I could do that. I could watch All American. I haven't finished that. But yeah, that's the plan. But I just wanted to show you guys um, the new things I'm getting for back to school. My next back to school series video will be what's in my backpack. And that'll be out probably in a couple weeks. I start school in a week and a half. So it'll be out soon. So yeah, like always, like and subscribe um if you're new here thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it and subscribe to me i would really appreciate it i'm so excited to get some back to school videos out to you guys in like school morning routines night routines right now all i've been doing is vlogs because i honestly don't know what else to film so i'm really excited to get into a new groove new videos new content i'm so excited so if you want to see more of videos like this, back to school videos, productivity, college, lifestyle, subscribe to me and um, I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.